If you're someone that's just starting out on this meal prep journey, you're going to need a scale. This one I have had since the beginning of time. I've had it for a very, very long time. So I know that it holds up fairly well. Um, I use it quite often. It does have features on it at this point that perhaps I don't need as much because I have been meal prepping for several years now. But let's go ahead and take a look at it and look at some of the features that I think um, are really useful. So looking at this scale, it does come with this little booklet, which we'll go over in just a few minutes, but it has buttons on the side for you to turn on and off. And it also has another button on the side where you can change it from ounces to grams, ounces to grams. Um, if you're in some sort of prep, sometimes coaches prefer you to measure things in grams versus ounces, and it can be kind of confusing sometimes. So this can take a lot of headache out of um, trying to just measure things with a cup, and it's a little bit more exact when it comes to weight. So I definitely recommend this if you're someone that is really trying to dial things in with a lot more perfection. Um, so let's go ahead and turn it on. Um, all you do is hit the button on the side. I typically use the ounces versus the grams. And it's unsettled. It will tell you also if the surface is not flat enough and it's not setting properly. So let me turn it on and not touch it. Give it a second. Now it's under grams. All I do is switch it into ounces. And you'll see the weight. It will come up to a zero. Now, you can take something, uh, let's say you already have food in a container, you don't want to empty it out, you can just place the food on top and press a zero. It will automatically bring it back down to zero, then you can put whatever food that you need to put into it and weigh it out. That is a hugely, um, that's extremely convenient, just so that you don't have to try to measure everything out singly and then you don't really always necessarily want to put food onto the actual um, scale itself. You want to keep that kind of clean. So that's a really, really nice feature to have. Now, then I can go back to zero. You can always go back and press zero, 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 zero. It can save different things. It can clear. Um, there's a lot of different features on it, but I'm going to go over the most basic feature. So this booklet right here has a lot of different, um, a lot of different uh, categories in it. Um, there's the table of contents has fruit, vegetables, grains, baked goods, red meat, poultry, pork, fish, sausage, dairy, egg, nuts, seeds, soups, sauces, snacks. Um, all you have to do is rather than go to some particular app on your phone or constantly have to go back and forth to the internet to look up what something might be, it's very easy to find it in these lists. And then you just plug in the number. So all you have to do is, let's say, let's just open it up. We'll find something random. All right. Well, okay. The first thing that caught my eye is anchovies, <laughs> which no one ever eats. But let's just say, okay, there's the number 1101. All you got to do is come over here, 1101. And it will plug in the food code up here. Now, once you have that food code, you put whatever you have on there, you can press zero, and then whatever it weighs, and it will tell you the calories, the fat calories, the total fat, the cholesterol, the sodium, the carbs, the fiber, the sugars, the protein, and then it'll tell you the ounces as well. Or like I said, you can switch it to grams. Super, super convenient. Super, super convenient. I really, really love this. And like I said, it's got so many different features inside of it. There's so many. I think this is an excellent investment. And if you're someone that is going to be meal prepping for a very long time, and maybe you just want to switch your meals up a little bit without having some of that headache of trying to figure out, is this protein the same amount of protein as this? Is this carbs the same amount of carbs as this? How many ounces? It can be really confusing. And if you're going to be in this lifestyle, it's, it's going to be important to learn. It's really going to be important to learn. Like I said, this is battery operated. It will automatically turn off by itself, which I really love that feature because sometimes I forget. Um, I've had really great luck with this actual scale. Um, I really don't have anything bad to say about it. 
I really don't and the cost I'm not sure of the exact cost I will leave some links down in the description so you can um, find it yourself on Amazon and um, take a look at it and see if this is something that could help you in your journey like I said I really really love it it's just it has so many options so many amazing things you know I mean it, it breaks down if your pork is baked uh, whole what 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 kind the blade um, if it's the liver uh, bone in bone out I mean it's extreme it from ground meat beef ground meat 70% lean 30% fat how however you cooked it broiled I mean and some of that mm, maybe it isn't quite necessary and that might not defer from you know some of the others <laughs> but I, I think if you're going to be in this lifestyle it's going to be good to learn the more you see something over and over and over again the more it's going to stick into your mind I can literally look at a plate of food and pretty much guess the macronutrients in it and the calories at this point in the game I've built so many diets but it's just super convenient there's lamb in here baked goods um yeah I, I, this is just amazing. It's so thorough as opposed to just a scale that you buy for probably maybe somewhere near the same cost. Um, but it's just not going to do the same thing, unfortunately, unfortunately, and you're going to constantly have to refer. So this can make things a lot easier. Meal prepping can be such a headache and time consuming. This can really um, help improve that time of getting things done and maybe switching around some nutrients so you can have a little bit more um, flexibility within your diet as well for all you people that do you know IIFYM things like that but just thought I would share it with you please like and subscribe I would love that if you have any questions in reference to the scale let me know I'd love to hear about uh, whatever scale you use and um, if you do decide to purchase it, let me know um, how it works out for you. I'm a huge fan of this scale. Um, my son has been able to learn from it as well. So if your kids are trying to go on a diet, it works just as good for them too because it, it really is just straight to the point, which I really love. I like that. Don't beat around the bush with me. Give it to me. Give me the information. <laughs> Thanks everyone for watching. I truly appreciate you being a part of what I do. And I'll see you next time. Bye.